Would everyone please rise and join me in the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Welcome to the 2020 Chillicothe High School commencement exercises. To the class of 2020, many or most of you started your educational career in 2007 in kindergarten, when at that time the iPhone was just being invented and put out on the market. You're ending your high school careers tonight in the middle of a pandemic. These large and dramatic changes around us and the adversity that comes with it make your class unique. With these adversities and changes, you have had to show grit and determination. Because of these adversities and because of this grit, I am confident that these experiences make the class of 2020 ready to be highly successful in whatever venture they may pursue next in life. It is an honor and privilege to welcome all parents, grandparents, family members, and friends to the 2020 Chillicothe High School commencement exercises. This ceremony signifies that these students have met the requirements established by the Missouri Department of Elementary and Secondary Education and are now ready to move into the next phase of their lives. On behalf of the faculty, staff, and administration of Chillicothe High School and the Board of Education of the Chillicothe R2 School District, we extend our heartfelt congratulations and best wishes for a successful future to each and every one of you. It has been a long-standing tradition that Chillicothe High School selects two of its own seniors to deliver commencement addresses. Today, our first speaker will be Madeline Wilford, daughter of Amanda and Brad Wilford. She will be followed by Macy Gutshaw, daughter of Angie and Bill Gutshaw. Chillicothe High School, class of 2020. What a wild ride it has been. The journey has been long and hard at times, but we made it. And now we are gathered here to celebrate the fact that we finally finished high school. After four long years, it is now our time to shine. We have been through so much as a class. We were born during 9-11 when the nation was under attack. And here we are today, graduating straight out of a pandemic. Through thick and thin, we have all been courageous and became the best people we can be. And a quote by Gabrielle Giffords, an Arizona politician who survived an assassination attempt, perfectly sums up our senior year. After her attempted assassination, Giffords gave a commencement address at Brad College, and in her address she said, be bold, be courageous, be your best. Her quote perfectly describes our unprecedented senior year. The quote starts with be bold. I believe that we each have the power to be bold in everything we do and that our boldness is what makes us unique. As we sit here today in our matching caps and gowns, the crowd may have a hard time telling us apart. Although we may look the same today, each person in the graduating class of 2020 is unique and bold in their own way. Among us, we have artists, comedians, athletes, and intellectuals. The fact that we are each bold in our own way is what makes us so strong together. 
The second part of Gifford's quote is be courageous. The key to success is courage. Being courageous means not only pushing past the failures, but also continuing through successes, knowing that failure is a possibility. As soon as the ceremony is over, we're going to go our separate ways. Some of us will head to college. Some of us will attend a great trade school. And some of us have already entered the workforce. After taking a moment to celebrate our graduation, we're going to be entering the real world with no one there to hold our hands. It is then that we must not be afraid of failure and truly be courageous in order to be successful. While our boldness is what makes us unique, it is our courageousness that will lead us to success. Gifford ends by saying, be your best. The class of 2020 has been through so much together. We were born during national crisis, and now, 19 years later, we are graduating in the middle of a pandemic in July. Even so, we are here today to celebrate the fact that we have done our best and been our best in order to finish a whole 13 years of school. Being here on this day, at this moment, for this ceremony, to walk across this stage is not something to take lightly. Graduating is something we should each be extremely proud of accomplishing. Many of us have had to overcome multiple obstacles individually, but we have all had to overcome obstacles as a class. Because of the COVID-19 pandemic, our senior year was cut short. Even though some may say we had the ultimate senior skip day, I do not think any of us were expecting our senior year to end the way it did. And most of us were devastated when we found out the last two months of senior year would not be happening in a normal school environment. However, even after being faced with the uncertainty of having a graduation or not, we all worked hard to finish our classes to the best of our abilities. And it is our perseverance through times such as these that helped us become the best versions of ourselves. Whether it is being boldly unique or courageously successful, the class of 2020 is truly the best that it can be. We have been through so much together from walking through the front doors as freshmen to finally winning the Spirit Sticks senior year to graduating during a pandemic. Chillicothe High School's graduating class of 2020 is bold, courageous, and truly the best that it can be. I am proud to be able to graduate with all of you. As we walk across this stage, remember to be proud of your accomplishments and to always strive to be your best. Thank you. We finally made it to today. It has been a long journey here, but we made it. Many past graduates have had the chance to say these same words, but they mean so much more to us. We have gone on a voyage that none of us expected. Most of us expected a traditional high school graduation and into our senior year. One where our baccalaureate was live, not virtual. One where our graduation ceremony was May 10th, not July 24th. One where our last day of in-person classes was May 5th, not March 16th. None of the COVID-related events this year were expected. So the end of the year came with disappointments and uncertainty. Even so, the adversity we faced in 2020 may be an opportunity for us to be better. As Arthur Ashe, a former tennis player who won three Grand Slam single titles, once said, 
Start where you are, use what you have, do what you can. Well, class of 2020, this is what I can say about us. We did what we could. We used what we had, and now we can start where we are. As the class of 2020, we did what we could. We started by learning how to read. We took ourselves from basic math to complicated algebra. We grew and expanded our science knowledge. We got taller and became better at sports. We became better musicians and artists. And during unprecedented quarantine times, we were flexible. We did Zoom calls. We learned how to do all classwork virtually. We improved our time management and were creative in our use of time while stuck at home. In addition, we gained a new appreciation for the efforts of our teachers and administrators as they also adapted and tried new ways of teaching. Not only have we done what we could, but we have also used what we had. We started by reading sight words from memory to then move to novels. We used paper and a pencil to add two plus two and then added the alphabet into algebra. We watched videos about aquatic animals and then performed our own experiments. We had growing pains, but then won the girls basketball district championship. We learned the color wheel and then created a mural. And during unprecedented quarantine times, we took advantage of the time we live in with the use of technology. We used Chromebooks that were provided for each and every student. We used apps like TikTok to inter interact with one another. At the same time, we noted that not every high school senior is lucky enough to have these circumstances. And now we can start right where we are. We all have in front of us a new beginning and a fresh start. We have the opportunity to look at the hardships we faced and realize that they have prepared us even more for our futures. I believe we have what it takes to leave a mark here because of the difficulties we have encountered. We will be known as the class that overcame and moved forward with more confidence than before. The difficulties of middle school seem minor as we have matured, and the difficulties of today will likely diminish as well. These times taught us lessons that will last. We entered this world at a time when things were uncertain. 9-11 of 2001 was near the birth of many of us graduates, and now we are leaving high school under the same circumstances, circumstances of uncertainty. Even so, we have grown and pushed through. We have become overcomers, and now we are here. We are graduating high school. We are taking the next big step of our lives, a leap rather, one that may look scary, but one that is exciting. As we start from where we are, I want each of you to consider the following questions. As the numbers in the year 2020 would suggest, is your vision clear? Do you have your focus set? A meaningful story from scripture shows us that a woman named Esther used her path, plan, and purpose to save her people. It specifically states that it was for such a time as this. Much like Esther, we were made and equipped for such a time as this. Each of us has our own specific path, plan, and purpose. We now have to take this next step. Whether that means you are ready to be a passionate English teacher, an excited paramedic, a dedicated athlete, or a hardworking farmer, embrace the next step. Chase after it. Look for good. Do not be afraid to dream. The world will try to knock you down in your circumstances. However, use those around you. Never feel like you have to do this life alone. Find a mentor and a friend. Remember this time and how adversity taught us all to push through when times are tough. Although the entry into life after high school may look quite a bit different for us than it did students in the past, the significance and pride that comes with graduation is no less than it has ever been. I count it a privilege to stand before you today to say, 
Congratulations, fellow classmates of the class of 2020. We finally did it. On behalf, On behalf of the, of the class, class of 2020, 2020 I, I present the students, students teachers, teachers, and staff of Chillicothe High, High School our contribution toward the gymnasium tarp flooring system that is used for commencement exercises. The funding for this project has been made possible through the dedication of our classes, or our class, and the classes of 2018, 2019, and 2021. It gives me great pleasure to accept this gift on behalf of the faculty, staff, administration, and the students of Chillicothe High School. The new TARP system for the Chillicothe High School gym has been a wonderful addition to our campus and will help our community remember the many contributions of the CHS class of 2020. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening. Graduating Good evening. class of 2020, tonight, finally, it is an honor and privilege to recognize you and present you to the Board of Education. I would like to take this opportunity to recognize the Chillicothe R2 Board of Education seated here on the platform. President Lauren Horseman, Vice President Lindy Chapman, Treasurer Clint Williams, members Bill Hand, Paul Thomas, Bryce Walker, and Kathy Gilliland. I would also like to recognize our most recent past board member who had an influence on these graduates and district, Pat Jones. To each of you, I thank you for your commitment, goals, and direction for our district, this graduating class, and future classes to come. Also on this platform with us today, our Assistant Superintendent, Dr. Zach McMains, High School Principal, Dan Nagel, and Counselor, Buffy Tipton. I would also like to recognize the co-senior class sponsors, Mrs. Buffy Tipton and Mrs. Fallon Forbes, who spent much time with these graduates, and also as recognized by the Class of 2020 and the administration, a special thank you to Mrs. Cindy Baker our college and career ready counselor for her support and encouragement to this class to each of you i thank you for your service and commitment to these graduates the class of 2020 consists of much talent we have witnessed their excellent performance both in and out of the classroom from the leadership and technical skills they possess to their academic performance their athletic success and their involvement in student organizations. This class has provided numerous positive examples for others to follow. You, the class of 2020, are much appreciated and will be greatly missed. I personally want to thank the parents of these graduates for sharing your daughters and sons with us. On behalf of the Board of Education, staff, and administration, we extend our congratulations and best wishes to each of your graduates. You are an outstanding class. This likely is the last time the class of 2020 will all be together at one time. So graduates, as you and your classmates prepare to go in different directions, I believe it's important that we recognize and share your accomplishments before you leave. Of the 123 graduates, 34 students will attend a four-year college or university. 36 students will attend a two-year college. 14 students will attend a vocational or trade school. Two students will enter the military. 24 students will enter the workforce. 
and 13 students are undecided at this time with what their future holds. 75 members of the graduating class have qualified for a school scholarships. These students must have maintained a 2.5 GPA, have a 95% attendance rate since ninth grade, consistently be a good school and community citizen, and perform 50 hours of tutoring prior to her graduation. Would those completing the A-plus program please stand and be recognized. In addition to receiving their diploma today, 20 students will receive their college prep certificate and 76 students will receive their technical preparatory certificate. The following students have maintained a B plus grade average over four years. Please stand when I call your name. Wesley Bransgar, Calloway Chapman, William Kiefer, Emma Burnsgetter, Caroline Witt, Dawson Wheeler, Cassandra Leach, Kylie Kirkpatrick, Brendan Sharp, Jordan Hibner, Cameron Dudley, Macy Gutshaw, Charles Path, Olivia Lamp, Brendan Nelson, Clarissa Nivens, Hunter Keithley, Montana Hall, Christina DeJesus, Macy Cavanaugh, Emma Ship, Isaac Washburn, Madeline Wilfer, Caleb Mulliken, Montana Plattner, Kimber Roberts, Desiree Crawford, Isaac Rashi, Noah Crow, Rachel Poole, Elena Mason, Ariel Doyle, Hayden Hill, Luke Hopper, Kennedy Corzett, Gavin Samson, Haley Kidd, Kimberly Poole, Grace Eden, Audrey Missouri, Josie Reeder, Drew Minnis, Graham Myers, Emma Smith, Skylar Chapman, Reese Jezembowski, Bradley Riley, Danielle Madison, Maggie Thomas, Olivia Cross, Christopher McCarthy, Austin Minnis, Allie Cromick, Dylan Holder, Cameron Dush, Kimberly Horn, Madison Eskew, Clayton Tiblow, Maya Lee, and Jonathan Evans. Congratulations to all of you. To receive a Bright Flight Scholarship, a student must score a 31 or above on the ACT. Two seniors have achieved this distinction. Bright Flight students, William Kiefer, and Brendan Sharp, please stand. Forty members of the graduating class of 2020 have earned a total of 715 college credit hours. Will all the students who have completed college credit hours please stand? Family members and guests, 
I skipped the spot. Collectively, the class of 2020 has earned 1.5 million in local college and vocational technical school scholarships, which is a true testament to their hard work and perseverance. Family members and guests, please join with me one more time in applauding the successes of these graduates. Chillicothe R2 graduating class of 2020, your future begins now. Today and every day forward, your independence grows stronger. Responsibilities given to you and choices that you possess are truly yours to own. As I tell each graduating class, be sure to tell your parents and family members, thank you for helping you during your high school years and for attending this very special night. And if you have the opportunity to see your teachers and sponsors, I hope you will thank them also for their help, support, and guidance they have given you over the past years. As I am certain their wisdom and knowledge has given many of you a direction for your future career. High School Principal Dan Nagel, Board President Lauren Horseman, and members of the Chillicothe R2 School Board, I am pleased to acknowledge that these 123 members of the Chillicothe High School Class of 2020 have met all the requirements set forth by the State of Missouri and all requirements set forth by the Chillicothe R2 School District. I present this graduation, graduating class to you for the awarding of their diplomas. Before I present the graduates of the class of 2020, I would like to take a moment and recognize and thank a few people who have made today possible. I would like to thank Mr. Adam Mass for recording our ceremonies and live streaming them so all the family and friends are able to view the ceremony that may not have been attended tonight due to restrictions and the pandemic. I would like to thank the CHS custodial staff of Johnny McLean, Yvette Meyer, and Kyle Jones and the Chillicothe maintenance staff of Dennis Sturgis, Mike Jones, and Donnie Murrow for preparing the stadium and portable stage. Our office staff of Mary Lou Wilhoy, Lisa Wilson, and Andrea Graves. Our counselors, Ellen Chikoya, Buffy Tipton, and Cindy Baker. Our senior sponsors, Fallon Forbes and Buffy Tipton. Assistant Principal, Tim Marsh, and all of our faculty, volunteers, for all of their efforts in ensuring today's ceremony will be memorable for our graduates and their families. Most importantly, I would like to recognize and thank the parents and guardians of the CHS class of 2020. I would ask the parents of our graduates to please rise so our seniors can give you a round of applause. Thank you for providing our graduates guidance and support and encouragement as they have worked to reach this special day. As the graduates' names are called, they will cross the platform and receive their diplomas from current Chillicothe R2 Board of Education President, Mrs. Lauren Horseman. I would ask you to hold your applause until all graduates have received their diplomas. Please refrain from creating excessive noise that will be disruptive to our ceremony. I would also ask the audience to please remain in their seats as the graduates walk across the stage so everyone may see with in an unobstructed view. I would ask the audience to remain seated afterward until all graduates and platform guests have exited the stadium. We will be dismissing in family groups from the top of the stadium down. The graduating students receiving the college prep certificate will be identified and will receive their certificates from Mrs. Buffy Tipton, junior and senior guidance counselor. 
To be eligible for this certificate, a student must carry a B average in all core courses taken, complete 24 units of credit with four units in communication arts, four in math, three in social studies, and three in science, plus three additional units in core areas. They miss they must, they must also, also have, have a 95% cu cumulative attendance and score at least a 21 on the ACT. We will we also recognize a second group of students who have qualified for the Tech Prep Certificate. The Grand River Technical School offers training for certification in 14 career fields that are recognized nationally and worldwide. Students have the opportunity to earn certificates of a completion in one of these programs if they meet the basic requirements, including mastery of competencies in their specific technical program completion of nationally normed technical skill assessment, 90% attendance, and a C average. Students completing a two-year program have the potential to earn up to 30 hours of articulated college credit. Will the graduates now approach the platform? Dawson, Dawson Sterling, Sterling Wheeler, Wheeler. College, College Prep, prep Tech, Tech prep, prep Certificate. certificate. Macy, Macy Lynn, Lynn Gutshaw, Gutshaw. Tech, Tech Prep, prep certificate. certificate. Isaac Aaron Washburn, College Prep Certificate. Josie Ann Reeder, Tech Prep Certificate. Luke, Luke Andrew, Andrew Hopper, Hopper. Tech, Tech Prep, Prep certificate. certificate. Christina, Christina Marie, Marie De Jesus. De Jesus. Isaac Austin Rashi, Rocky. College, College Prep, Prep certificate. certificate. Reese Wild Jezembowski, Tech Prep, Prep certificate. certificate. William Ace, Ace Kiefer, Kiefer College, College Prep, Prep and Tech, Tech Prep, Prep certificate. certificate. William is also the class valedictorian. Callaway Marie, Marie Chapman, Chapman College, College Prep, Prep Certificate. certificate. Callaway is, is also, also the class, class valedictorian. valedictorian.
Charles James Path, College Prep and Tech Prep Certificate. Macy, Macy Elizabeth, Elizabeth Cavanaugh. Cavanaugh. Kristen, Kristen Noah, Noah Gabrielle Crow, Crow College, College Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Kylie, Kylie Danae Kirkpatrick, Kirkpatrick. College, College Prep, prep and Tech and Prep, prep certificate. certificate. Madeline, Madeline Elizabeth, Elizabeth Wilford, Wilford. College, College Prep, prep and Tech and Prep, prep certificate. certificate. Jared Michael, Michael Ball. Ball. Madison, Madison Marie, Marie Ashlock, Ashlock. Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. certificate. Wesley Aaron Bransgar, College Prep Certificate. Wesley is also a class valedictorian. Emma Louise, Louise Bernsgetter, College, College Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Heston Earl Campbell, Campbell, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Trinity, Trinity Alexandra, Alexandra Marie, Marie Bowling. Bowling. Jameson, Jameson Francis, Francis Carr, Carr. Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. certificate. Kiera Olivia, Olivia Bosley. Bosley. Mackenzie Dawn, Dawn Campbell Rex, Rex. Tech, Tech Prep Certificate. certificate. Elijah, Elijah Rashawn, Rashawn Cook, Cook, Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Skyler Rochelle, Rochelle Chapman, Chapman, Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate.
Austin K. Dewey, Tech Prep Certificate. Kennedy Shea Corset, Tech Prep Certificate. Dustin Alexander Duckworth, Tech Prep Certificate. Olivia Madeline Ann Cross. Cameron Ray Dutch. Ariel Patricia Lynn Doyle, Tech Prep Certificate. Mason Kenneth Francis, Tech Prep Certificate. Cameron, Cameron Addison, Addison Dudley, Dudley Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Spencer, Spencer Lee, Lee Gillespie. Gillespie. Grace, Grace and Eaton. Eaton. Brock, Brock Mitchell, Mitchell Gott, Gott, Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. certificate. Emily, Emily Elise, Elise Ellis. Ellis. Garrett, Garrett Mason, Mason Greener. Greener. Madison, Madison Michelle, Michelle SQ, SQ, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Timothy, Timothy Tyler, Tyler Hart, Hart, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Jonna, Jonna Marie, Marie Goodwin. Goodwin. <laughs> Bradley, Bradley Ryan, Ryan Hand, Hand Tech Prep Certificate. certificate. Montana, Montana Tage, Tage Hall, Hall, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Elijah, Elijah Hawk, Hawk Hennington. Hennington.
Jordan Nicole Hibner, College Prep Certificate. Hayden Harper Hill. Dylan Christopher Holder, Tech Prep Certificate. Maria Elizabeth Horton, Tech Prep Certificate. Trent Logan, Logan Hook, Hook, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Abby, Abby Elaine, Elaine Jones, Jones, Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Tyler Jordan Huffman. Hunter Elena Keithley. Julius Gaylord Humphrey, Tech Prep Certificate. Haley Colleen Kidd, Tech Prep Certificate. Isaiah Edward, Edward Keeley, Keeley, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Allie, Allie Michaela, Michaela Cromack. Cromack. Bryce, Bryce Allen, Allen Leatherman. Leatherman. <laughs> Olivia, Olivia Renee, Renee Lamb, Lamb. College, College Prep, prep and Tech, tech prep, prep Certificate. certificate. Tommy, Tommy Joe, Joe Mace. Mace. Cassandra, Cassandra Marie Leach, Leach. College, College Prep, prep and Tech and Prep, prep certificate. certificate. Graham Edmund Myers, College Prep and Tech Prep Certificate. Dylan Edward McAdams. Elena Cassidy, Cassidy Mason, Mason, College, College prep, prep and Tech, and tech prep, prep Certificate. certificate.
Jacob Daniel Meyer Tech Prep Certificate. Audrey Jane Missouri. Samuel James Missouri, Tech Prep Certificate. Kennedy Nicole Munson, Tech Prep Certificate. Austin Monroe Menace, Tech Prep Certificate. Clarissa Grace Nivens. Drew Joseph Menace, Tech Prep Certificate. Montana Faith Platner, Tech Prep Certificate. Caleb Jordan Mulligan, College Prep Certificate. Caden Marie Holler. Joe, Joe Dean, Dean Neal. Neal. Kimberly, Kimberly Mary, Mary Poole, Poole, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Brendan, Brendan Scott, Scott Nelson, Nelson, College, College Prep, Prep and Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Rachel, Rachel Arlene, Arlene Poole. Poole. Trent Christopher Norman, Norman Tech Prep Certificate. Kimber Sue Roberts, Tech Prep Certificate. Tech Prep Certificate. Ryan Neil Harbor H. H, Tech Prep Certificate. Sarah Rose Schuler. Joseph Handholzer, Tech Prep Certificate. Hunter Michael Rader, Tech Prep Certificate.
Emma Deanne Schiff, Tech Park Certificate. Elijah, Elijah Brian, Brian Reynolds. Reynolds. <laughs> Emma, Emma Grace, Grace Smith, Smith, College, College Prep, Prep Certificate. certificate. Bradley, Bradley William, William Riley. Riley. Maggie, Maggie Rebecca, Rebecca Thomas, Thomas, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. certificate. Keegan, Keegan James, James Lane, Lane Reinhardt. Reinhardt. <laughs> Caroline Nicole, Nicole Witt, Witt, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. certificate. Gavin Michael, Michael Samsel, Tech Prep Certificate. Noel Christopher Santos. Colton Robert, Robert Sewell, Sewell, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Brendan Garrett, Garrett Sharp, Sharp, College, College Prep, Prep and Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Isaiah, Isaiah William, William Smith. Smith. Jonathan, Jonathan Alex, Alex Smith, Smith. Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. certificate. Sonny, Sonny Lee, Lee Smith. Smith. Clayton, Clayton Dale, Dale Tiblow, Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Joseph, Joseph Chase, Chase Tullis, Tullis, Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate. Clayton Owen, Owen Walker, Walker, Tech, Tech Prep, Prep Certificate. Certificate.
Camden James Ward. Cullen Jacob Williams, Tech Rep Certificate. Skyler Rain Lloyd Wilson. Jaden Reese Weiner, Tech Rep Certificate. Will the graduates, graduates please, please stand? stand. Ladies and gentlemen, it gives, it gives me great, great pleasure, pleasure to, prevent, to, present to present the Chillicothe High, High School, School, School graduating class, class of 2020. Of 2020. Graduates, please be seated. Before the graduates exit, we have one final surprise for the class of 2020. Everyone, please remain seated and socially distanced for this final surprise. We would like to thank the local businesses for sponsoring advertising on the video board in order to make this last final surprise possible. Donnie, hit the lights.